God be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. Yeah. And now here we are, we find ourselves inside a pandemic where we're back to the discussion. <laughs> and so I don't know about you, but you know, I, I want to have the discussion as many times I need it. I want to be upbraided as many times I need to be upbraided. Amen. <laughs> Amen, man. Amen. Until finally the light comes on, I realize. I so I, 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 I've been making some very uh, critical notes, man. And I while we were talking, I got some light on the birth man that I think I, I, I just flat out misunderstood. Ooh. Now, I, I quoted that verse from Galatians chapter 5, verse number 6. And that verse said, You want to bring it up? You can bring it up. And see, that's why I say ignorance is a, is a contributing factor because a lot of times what we find out. Is that we we we've got the wrong interpretation on the wrong meaning of the verse. I shouldn't say we we've got we've taken something to be truth that is not true. Mm -hmm. Now that this text says, for in Christ Jesus, in Jesus Christ, in the kingdom, need the circumcision availeth anything. No, I'm so confused. But faith, which worketh by love. Which is what Elder was, like God was telling, using the Elder to talk about, bring, it, bring love in it. <laughs> un unbelief, unbelief is a showstopper right here. Yeah. Now let me ask a question. What are you talking about? When you speak the term circumcision, uncircumcision, I think he was talking about the state of the, the, the Jews to uh, the Gentiles. Yeah. Okay, so you, so don't worry. Wait, he's saying, this, talking he's about saying this thing is not a, a circumcised man or uncircumcised man. This Faith. thing is just talking about the human element, period. period. Faith. Yeah, okay. By love. Work is by love. Okay, what else? Talk about the faith workers by love. Yes. Love is a, is a foundation. Yep. God is love. So basically, but, but listen now. But, but the verse says, "Faith which worketh by love." By love. Yeah. So you 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 can't without God you can't have love. You got to first you got to have that, and then. Without that love, you can't have faith. You can't have faith. Now, so, you can have it, but it won't be effective. It, well, it won't be. It, it, it won't be the. the it won't the, manifest. It won't manifest the kingdom. Right. It will not manifest the kingdom. So. So it says faith without works is dead, right? Uh -huh. so, so if there's no working of faith, then it's dead. There's no. There's no evidence of it. Indeed. It, it, this all boils down to, to, to the, to the Great Commission, or whatever you want. To call it. <laughs> I think it's all or, 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 or what you want to call it, um, and that that is reconciling souls. Reconciling well, right, right. souls. So, so that's that's what it boils down to: reconciling souls. So, in doing so, it's letting you know that, first of all. Gotta do my love. <laughs> First of all, you gotta know God, who yeah. is love. Amen. Amen. And then you gotta know what God did because of God's love, and that was He gave His Son, uh -huh. which is 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 love. Yes, sir. And then without knowing that the unconditional love that God gave for us, we can't truly love ourselves unconditionally. Mm. And until we love ourselves unconditionally, we can't truly love another unconditionally so we we got to first know what love is love is God. and so and in, in learning what love is then we can practice faith which is sharing the gospel wow. faith well, now, now, is sharing up. the gospel because faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of god 
Okay. And so faith is those things hoped for, the evidence of God, that, that which is not seen. Okay. So that that's all that is letting us know is that it takes the love of God to share the gospel mm. by faith. Go ahead, well, you, here's a mistake I made. I was clear on the faith part. I understood that when it says, but faith was working by love, I understood that the, that the text, the whole of scripture proclaims that this faith that we're talking about comes by hearing. Yes. And this hearing we're talking about, really, really what they're saying is that God is on the hook to, to speak to you mm. by some means. Okay. By his spirit, either within you uh -huh. or by his spirit in a sent vessel. Woo! Amen. But regardless of what form it takes, God must speak. Yes. In order for faith to have a possibility. Yes, Amen. sir. Now, it's that is the law. That this faith works by love. Mm. The problem I had was, you see, if faith is the result of something that God is doing, his speaking, why would this love not be the result of something that God is doing? Uh-huh, uh-huh. See, I thought this verse was talking about my love for God. Okay. His love, huh? But if you make this verse homogenous, it says that everything in this verse is being wrought by God. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Even your faith. Okay. Because the verse says faith comes. Does that come from where? Uh, right here in the Word of God. So, so, so within the heart of man, when the heart has been brought to that place where it has been broken and brought to a place of contrition and sorrow, and it now realizes that it ain't what that it ain't what it thought it was. I ain't all of that. It now realizes, in other words, it cries out, God help me. Amen, man. You see, God got to bring you to a place where you're open to realize, God, I need you. I need you. Uh -huh. This, see, these are the people who understand the real essence of the kingdom. Uh -huh. If you come because you got marital problem, or because you got financial problem, or because you got problem with your job, or you got some something that's or your health is failing, you've come for the wrong reason. Yeah. Uh -huh. That's a problem. And if that problem gets solved, you'll forget about God. But when you when you stand before God and realize the problem is me, uh -huh. <laughs> I'm the problem. <laughs> That's who salvation is for. Woo! Salvation is for those who have been brought to the end of themselves. Wow. So, if faith comes by hearing God, when you hear God speak, in a heart that is that in a heart that has the right inward disposition. Woo! In other words, the me in you uh -huh. has been broken. Wow. You, for the first time in your life, you're looking away from yourself. Yes, sir. If any man come after me, let him deny himself. Yes, sir. You're looking away from yourself, and now you're open for some water from a well. That's what Jesus told that woman at the well, you see. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I call it the well at the well. Yes, sir. Jesus says, you don't realize that I'm a well. <laughs> And I got my own water, but it's of a different kind. Now you Come got your now. water, and you can draw from it. But I'm a well, and I got my own water. And if you'd ask me for some of it, I'd give you the drink. So, so in this text, you see, everything is in is the, is the result of the workings of God. We have been brought to the place where we're open and receptive, and dependent <laughs> upon the grace of God, which means in grace, <clears throat> the difference between law and grace is law requires you to work. And grace brings you to the place where you trust God to work. Yes, God. Yeah. Because yeah. I was saying, El, El, this, I don't have to add what I was thinking about when you were talking was Cain heard from God. Yes. But his heart condition was not right to receive it. Yeah. I mean, that's. The hard thing is serious now. 
And that, that it was hard. They said, I don't care. The yeah. heart is yeah. just yeah. wicked. Yeah. That is why you have to be willing to abandon yourself. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's wickedness and evil. And, but you've exalted yourself in the place of God, for you are under your own sovereign rule. Woo! Under your own sovereign reign. <laughs> you decide what's good. Wow! You what's, evil, what's right and wrong. You, you decide what is truth. And we're living in a time now where there's becoming a law of the land. Every man decides what is good in his own eye. Uh, That's right. That's uh, right. No, I, That's right. <laughs> Yeah, other words too. I'm saying I got it. Adam heard from God. Cain heard from God. But they still, because their heart hearkened not to his voice. You see what I'm saying? You can hear, but if you your heart ain't right, if it's hard with unbelief, it doesn't matter. Well, hear, hearing and taking heed is two different things. A lot of people hear it. That don't mean they heard and moved on it. You know, my yeah. dad was like this right here. Uh, he did right there. People ask me something about, well, what, 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 what would have happened if your dad had to say something twice? I have no idea. It never happened. Because <laughs> let me tell you something. He knew, he knew, he knew you heard him. And, and, and his thing was, I know you heard me because right heard after you. I finished talking, your butt jumped up and started doing something. See, that's how he knew. But let me tell you something. You know what, what came to me when you were saying that, Lee, was uh, was uh, when you say you don't come there for financial problems or health problems, all these kind of things. If you do, you come for the wrong reason. But, you know, we've made that the appeal mm -hmm. so often now to people think that's the gospel, that you come there yeah. and the hospital to get your problems Amen. fixed. Amen. And that's what we that's what we created. In other words, we've created that to be the, the, the supply. And then, of course, that means the man. But the, it takes me back to to, to seek ye first Woo. the kingdom of God. And then all those things, they, they automatically going to be added. But now we've made the things that are supposed to be added the main thing to seek. Yeah. Uh, we, I mean, we got it all backwards. Yeah. When he told us what to seek, and then it, that all comes with it. And therefore, too, again, kind of takes us right back to that kingdom of God. Take yeah. you right back to the gospel right. of the kingdom. Yeah. And he said to seek that first and foremost beyond all things. And then everything else that we ever desire is up. part of that package. Yeah, we add up. And, and, and what, matter of fact, we get so much to chew on, I, I think even my head up. Uh, Elder Johnson, get ready for the communion, please. <laughs> yes, sir. That's a lot to chew on. <laughs> it's a good morning. It's a very good morning. Uh, we must be about to go to work, gentlemen. <laughs> That's a lot to chew on. I see Brother Addison. <laughs> I'm just thinking how, uh, you know, where we started and, and where we where where we are now. Oh, I don't yeah. want to say where we ended. Because right. It, it definitely has not ended. Amen. But uh, I'm just looking at the dynamic of how the Holy Spirit <laughs> just brings, brings a collective <laughs> into focus onto a certain thing that it wants us to get it does right and and that, and that dynamic is just awesome how each one is teaching one each one is given god is using each one of us no different than uh uh bishop was saying yeah that 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 we all have some things that we need to learn from each other amen we don't get it all right I know a part of prophesizing part. Yes, sir. I tell you, God, God is awesome. I tell you, he 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 truly answered my prayer when he put you guys in my life. Amen. There is a, I think the revival in America has started, and it, and we're evidence of it. There is a rise that has to take place if the country is going to really sustain for another few hundred years, another hundred years. Something has to change morally about it. But then the men that are put forth the bring about that change gonna have to change first yeah and the so when you does, say this country what what do you mean because it, this well, country I mean, does not matter it well, really when i look matter. at when i look at the united states of america i, I see a vineyard and it, it's a place to you know go reaping the harvest and, and we have been placed here by will of god to seek this this bit to, to reap this bit this this harvest and i and i see the revival that's taking place is in us we're getting better prepared to go out and reap this harvest for the kingdom. Um, and, and, and that's, that, you know, that's basically, I mean, we, we are regionally 
you're geographically located. And so the United States of America is our field. Yeah. The United States of America needs reaping. We have a generation of children out there that don't even know Jesus, man. Come on, brother. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sad, sad to say. We gotta yeah. preach the real gospel now. I mean, yes, sir. I go to church and now everybody's preaching stuff. Right. Well, I tell you, I mean, Satan has filled a void. He really, he really has. has. <laughs> he has he filled really a void. I mean, there's so many different things going on. I mean, how long has this 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 true Israelite stuff been going on? You know? Oh yeah. Not 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 very, very long. You know, if if long at all. I don't know when it actually came about. But there, there, are, there are some things that are, are popping up. You know, there was uh, Scientology, you know, and all this other stuff. There's a void that's being filled because we are not in our rightful space. Exactly. In our rightful place. We, we're, but but I, I, I do believe that uh, we, we are the ram in the bush. Yeah. We, 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 we are set aside to go out here and start doing some damage to this 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 kingdom of darkness and uh amen and uh, you know the funny thing about it we're being taught to fight spiritually and not carnal we're, we're even raised to do. we're not really functioning in the, in the carnal realm anymore we've moved away from that and we're actually being strengthened spiritually which means we should be more effective than what came before that is the point uh that you brought up that i i've been trying to deal with now because even when uh jesus told peter get behind me say he was not talking to peter amen man you're right yes amen right. talking to the demonic forces that were dominating peter at that time right. because there was another force that had just Talk taken hold of him prior to exactly and see we have to recognize the difference in between what we're dealing with when we're dealing with these souls out here and we're not going to talk to the to person. Uh -huh. We're talking to the demonic forces that are controlling, attacking, and 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 holding these people in bondage. Yes, sir. No Amen. different than Christ did. So Amen. we take these spiritual truths and we attack the spiritual realm. Right. You know something really funny about that though is that we have to be prepositioned to be effective there. Because the sons of Siva went out to cast out devils, they had the right idea. But the position was wrong. Right. Far we know. Right. So we know. Who are you? That's so, like the heart, not your heart. So yeah. we have to be positioned in such a manner that we don't our hearts on. So Amen. this conditioning program that we're going through right now, this upgrade of this, whatever we want to call it, it, it it's 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 for us. It's working. It, and and and, and, it, and we're gonna be used to bless people. Amen. I thank God for this, man. This is this is great. Blessing the saints to do the work of the ministry. That's what it's all about. This is great. Thank God for it. I just pray that 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 I pray for for our boldness. Yes, sir. Amen. I, I really do. I pray that yes. that we are bold in the things that 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 the Holy Spirit is is giving us, mm -hmm. and that He gives us the ability to share this with all simplicity to those who would have an ear to hear. And I just truly think that this this is a season of perfecting so that once this this particular time is over to where we can get back into the community, I'm not saying that we can't right now, but uh, that we are completely effective in the ministry that we've been given. Amen. I'm prophesied. Amen. When we perfect it, when we get perfected and we minister this last time, the rapture is going to occur. We Amen. come at the tail end of this dispensation and the brothers are going to be out there doing it. And then the Lord's going to show up and say, it's time to go home. Amen. I'm going to yeah, <laughs> man. Let's roll out. <laughs> All right, Alex, give us give us a communion. Because I took it way over time. <laughs> Amen, man. Amen. I got to chew on this. <laughs> yep. On the night that he was betrayed, he took bread, he blessed it. He broke it and gave it to his disciples and said, take, eat, all of you. For this is my body, which shall be broken for you. So he take it, and he blessed it, and he broke it and gave it to them, and they ate. Amen.
heal in my body. Amen. In my mind. In my mind. Hey, that's a that's the most important one right there. Amen, man. Woo. When supper was in it, he took the cup. Again, he gave thanks and prayed. He blessed it, gave it to his disciples and said, take, drink, all of you. But this is the cup of my blood. Yes, sir. The blood of the new and everlasting covenant. It shall be shed for you and for all men, so that sins may be forgiven. Whenever you do this, do it in remembrance of me. And so they drank. After that, they sang a song. Amen. And they went off into the garden to get something. Amen. Amen, man. You know, I thought you get ready to sing for a second. Chris got you singing somewhere. <laughs> oh, he does. <laughs> he got your video. He does. I hope it was a good song. Was it a gospel song while I sang it? <laughs> yes. 